Hey you all, thank you for stopping by. Today's clip, I want to show you how I prepare my hair for a dark red color. So uh, this is how my hair looks like one year after I colored it. So anyway, first of all, you'll start by uh, separating your hair into six sections. So this time round I want it halfway, you know, I want I need an ombre. So I'll use a hairband and tie up the hair. So uh, the part that I'm gonna color is the upper part. So that's it, I won't make it really tight. So I am going to the next section and I'll just do the same. the hair and yeah so this is the back part and um, yeah it's not too tight so um, I wanted to test something so I will take a, a little part of the hair and um, so that one will just be separately because I'll try to see if I don't really need to to bleach my hair next time so this part I'll just uh, use the red the uh, reddish color to get to get it um, colored so yeah here we go this is the hair color I'll be using so uh, I used it last time so this is called Sayos uh, in the blonde one so that's the uh, first part I need and then the, the stuff in the tube and uh, this is like a blonde booster, but I won't really be using it. And a conditioner is also inside. Then I bought this um, hair brush uh, for coloring the hair. So I'll test it and you'll see how it works. So let's go. Um, yeah, time to mix up the chemicals. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I just have to mix the two. So the package comes with a, um, a lead that has a nozzle tip, so this is what we are going to use. And of course it comes with a pair of gloves which I won't really be using because I prefer using the rubber gloves. for the work so um, the, uh, I'll just have to make sure that the chemicals are well mixed and then yeah so this is how I go about this First, I'll just make sure that all the sections are well coated with the uh, with the color, 
uh, yeah so I'll just do this to all of the sections and then I'll come back again and um, add up some more the first round and here we go to the second round of applying the hair dye yeah so I'll also try not to uh, dye the <laughs> the tiny bit you know because that's for the test so yeah here we go again second round now it's time to massage the hair just to make sure that uh, the hair dye gets onto all of my hair strands you know the parts that I want to be colored and I'll also need a comb you know to just go through the sections once again that's it so uh, yeah this is the back part and um, yeah like you can see I left that piece <laughs> and so time to wait so here we are again so uh, this is the color that I get <laughs> seriously <laughs> okay anyway uh, it's a dark blonde it's okay no problem I wasn't really expecting like a bright blonde but I mean I thought it would be uh, much lighter than this but it's okay this is gonna be great so um, yeah according to to the package package of the color that I want to have the main color so this is uh, what it shows the dark blonde so I think the blonde that I've got isn't as bad you know yeah so uh, time to wash this off and there is my color <laughs> that's the dark blonde that I finally came out with yeah well um, yeah you know I was thinking if I should leave it this way but now that I've got it mm -mm, it's not really my thing and we still have that tiny bit of hair which we will uh, try and do a test on so yeah, <laughs> I still like the red, so I'll go ahead with the red. <laughs> Guys, check out my next clip to see uh, the color that I finally end up with. I'm sure you're gonna love it. <laughs> 